Today we are at a primary school. The primary school kids are really fun because they're really excitable and they want to get involved. Our show is based on the things that the kids are learning in the curriculum, so it's nice that we can go into a school and do something really fun that's based on what they're learning in their classroom. Today we've got our Feel the Force show, which is our most popular show for primary schools, uh, all about the science behind forces. We'll take a look at Newton's laws, we're going to launch some rockets and do some impressive demonstrations. Also we're doing a workshop called Get a Grip, where the kids are going to get a chance to make their very own hovercraft and they're going to be able to take it home with them afterwards as well, which is uh, really nice. And also we have our storytelling, which is great for the younger ones to have a bit of a science experience as well. Taking a story that they know and love, such as Three Little Pigs, and putting more of a science slant onto it. I think I've really enjoyed seeing the children building their hovercrafts today. It's an idea I never would have thought of and it was presented so well. From a teaching point of view I felt it met a lot of objectives and our children really enjoyed it and I enjoyed it too, helping them to, to make something they can take home with them and use again. It's really important to me that children get to experience science. It's not enough for them to learn it through being told what the science is. They need to do it as well and see it as much as possible because that's how people really learn through the doing. Lots of people think you're not in London, things like the Science Museum aren't accessible to you because it's too far away. But actually being able to book the outreach service to come out to you, especially if you do like we did and link up with another school that you know in the area so it makes it feasible, it's a really good idea. Location shouldn't be a factor in whether you get good science or not really. The kids definitely find it fun, I think you can see that in their faces when they're watching the show and then they walk away at the end of the school day and they're like, oh bye, we've had a great time today. Mm -hmm.